What is going on, y'all? It is Far Gas here. Hopefully, you're having a great and wonderful day out there in the wasteland. Friends, today we're going to be talking about an update shared from Lady Devan over on the official Bethesda Discord. And I know you're going to be absolutely thrilled to hear this news. If you enjoy this type of content, make sure to hit that subscribe button that bell notification icon, and drop us a like. Let's get in here and talk about it, y'all. Wastelanders rejoice because this update is absolutely amazing. It is talking about the fire and energy damage. A Lady Devan posted on the official Bethesda Discord today. Hello, Vault Dwellers. We've seen you're about fire and energy damage and wanted to give you an update on what we are doing. Currently, we are undergoing a thorough sweep of fire and energy damage based on your incredible feedback. This will include changes to how damage is calculated and balanced updates for both enemies and armor. We'll have these changes ready for players to test in our next PTS release in early October and hope that you will let us know how things feel. More information on our next PTS will be provided in an Inside the Vault article later this month. And look, I'm already excited each time the playtest server comes out, but with this update, oh my lanta, I am so excited to see what changes they've made, how it feels, and what they've added to Fallout 76. Could it be the Atlantic City update, or do they have something else planned for us out there in the wasteland? And you might remember in a previous video, we talked about items not being able to be crafted if you learned them after the Season 14 update, but Lady Devan came in at the end of it and said, lastly, we wanted to address the reports of being unable to craft specific items such as the Union Power Armor and the Auto Axe. This is a priority for us and we have a solution to address this that will be in our next update and this makes me so excited for Wastelanders that have earned the Union Power Armor, the Auto Axe, the Centurion Helmet, the Ronin Helmet. There were so many on that list that were not able to be crafted and thank you so much to Bethesda and to Devil Eleven for working on this problem. So Wastelanders rejoice because I think we're going to finally have a reprieve from fire and electric damage out there in the wasteland friends let me know what you think about this in the comment section below thank you so much for checking this video out and i would love to thank our channel members frugan just jay curb cross blood sebastian nova prophet zach crm jesse blazement has bud cranberry relish gravy train bay i am mr me not you quinn indy andy warren coma patrick super loki megsley katie ghost petty lewis force james purple dazed ian darth zen matt stabby hokey Bo, yegar roto i go alex alejandro crab egbert hammer denison articular potus gaming vermilion Mike and D Mobster, thank you so much for supporting us out here in the wasteland. Y'all have a great and wonderful day, and we'll catch you in the wasteland later, friends. Peace, y'all.